हेलो एवरी वन टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अवर लेक्चर विद द चैप्टर नंबर वन बिल्डिंग विद ब्रिक्स सो स्टार्टिंग विद द चैप्टर नंबर वन बिल्डिंग विद ब्रिक्स ब्रिक पैटर्न फॉर जागृति स्कूल दिस इज द ट्रू स्टोरी ऑफ जागृति स्कूल इन मुर्शिदाबाद वेस्ट बेंगाल वेन इट्स बिल्डिंग वॉज बींग मेड देर वॉज अ प्लान टू मेक ब्रिक पैटर्न ऑन द फ्लोर एंड वॉल्स जमल Kalu and Pierre were the mason for the brick work. They wanted to get new ideas for the school building, so they took their other friends to see the old dorm of Murshid Khuli Khan. So, what is the scenario here? So, Jagriti School was being constructed. Okay. So, for making the patterns of floor and walls, Jamal, Kalu, and Pierre. needed some new ideas so that they can construct their school so with the help of their other friends they went to see the old tomb of murshid quli khan okay so this is the photo of murshid quli khan where they are going this building has a big floor with about 2000 beautiful brick pattern these were made by mason long back about 300 years ago See student, how many years ago? Three hundred years ago. Okay, so these are the some pictures. Look how the bricks are arranged in this five floor pattern. Okay, so this is the pattern one. This is the pattern two, three, four, and five. You can see in your textbook how beautiful these painting are there. So the first question is here: Which floor pattern do you like the most? So it is a personal type question you can select any of the five pattern but personally i like the four so my answer is four the second question is have you seen such pattern anywhere so we are all living in the mohua and in mohua we can't see this type of patterns we can't see this type of five pattern so the answer is no the mason came back excited jamal said ah in those day they had many so many interesting brick patterns we had forgotten this let us make some nice design on the floor of this school each mason made a different brick pattern the school is proud to have such a beautiful building children play and sing on it and also make new pattern themselves so they made a floor which look like this which consist of different pattern which are made from bricks okay so here are some of the patterns they have made in their school area a b c d e and f you can see this pattern in your textbook also so then g h i j k so there are total a to k patterns which they have made so from this pattern we have some question answer which pattern is made in circle so if you start from the a a b c okay d e f g h i j yes j is the pattern of circle you can see so now in which pattern can you show mirror half draw a line so what do you understand by mirror half we will see that first if you divide any picture into two equal parts then the first part and the second part should be equal okay so if we divide this j picture in the two parts like this so the first and the second picture look similar so the answer will be j okay all these pattern are of the mirror half you can see if you divide the a if you divide this p picture if you divide this c picture so every picture every pattern you are seeing here are having mirror half so all answer can be possible so now you draw some new floor pattern okay so now let's see the answer now you draw some new floor pattern so here is your answer this you can draw this three picture 1 
and 3 in your notebook if possible. So moving further, how to draw a brick? So this question we will see later on. So here how many faces in all does a brick have? So the answer is 6. I will explain you this later on. Is any face a square? No. The brick does not have any square faces. You can see this is rectangle, this is rectangle, this is also a rectangle. It does not have a square face. Draw the smallest side of the brick. So the answer is this. This is the smallest side of brick. Which of these are the faces of brick? So you know how brick looks like. Okay. So the answer is this and this. These are the two faces of the bricks. Which of these is the drawing of a brick? So from this you can see this is one pick and this is the second pick. So these are the two answers of this question. Which of these is a drawing of bricks? Mark a tick. Okay. Make a drawing of this box to show three of its faces. This we will see later on. Can you draw? Can you make a drawing of a brick which show four of its faces? Okay, so let's see the answer. So, how many faces in all does a brick have? Six. Is any face a square? No. Face of a brick is a square. No face of a brick is a square. The smallest side I have shown you in the uh, previous PDF. Okay. Two tick marks. These two answer we have completed. Okay. We will see this later on. The seventh question. Okay. Can you make a drawing of a brick which show four of it faces? No. We cannot make a drawing of a brick showing four of it faces. Because in a 3D figure of brick we can only show three faces. Okay. A wall that will not fall. One day Munya and Zainab are playing with the bricks and making their walls. Each make a different wall. So here you can see two walls made by two different children. Zainab and Munia. Zainab say her wall will not fall easily. Mason too do not put brick on one top of the other as Munia has done. Okay. So Zainab has observed in that tomb that at that time the construction was done like this which I am showing you here. Okay. So what do you think? Which wall will be stronger? Obviously the Zainab wall will be stronger because it, she has seen that wall in that tom. Okay. Look for the wall where you can see a different brick pattern. Okay. So in your house or near your house you can see whether the whether you can see the brick patterns or not. Okay. So different wall patterns. Next topic is different wall patterns. Here are the photos of three kinds of brick walls. Can you see the difference in the way of brick are placed? Let's see what is the difference. See, the first brick is like this. The second brick is like this. Then this way, this way. Okay, here you can see the difference in size, difference in length of a brick. The arrangement is different in this all three pictures. You can clearly see that. Now, match the photo of each one with the correct drawing below. So now what we have to do to match the following drawing. This is the real picture. This is the picture which we have made in the laptop or computer in the world. So now we have to match. So now if you watch carefully, you will notice that this first picture is matching with this one. Then this second picture is matching with this and the third one the last one is matching with this picture okay so now yes look through a brick jali jali means this all let me show you yes this is a jali yeah. okay so the mason who built 
Jagriti school had also made different jali patterns on the wall. Okay, see here you can see different jali patterns. Yes, yes, here, here you can see. So, how many different jali patterns can you see in these two photos? So, we have to identify how many jali patterns are there. So, let's count. This is the first pattern. These both patterns are these both patterns are same. The second pattern is this second and these are the other three three four and five so there are total five patterns one two three four and five so the answer of this question how many different jali patterns can you see in these two photos is five okay this is the drawing of other beautiful jali. This is the drawing of other beautiful jali. How? See how beautiful it is. Now, color some brick red and make your own jali pattern in the below drawing. So, in your textbook, you can color some of the bricks so that a jali can be formed. I will show you one example of it. See, if you color some of the bricks with the black color, and some of the bricks with the brown color black see here black color and with brown color then you will form a pattern of this kind okay let's see see if you color some bricks with a black color and some bricks with the brown color okay so you will form a pattern of a jali okay can you see a window in this photo of the school yes we can see this is one of the window yes this is a window okay now draw some now draw some patterns what charokha patterns on the wall here you can shade it in the black so let's see the answer now so drums now draw some chorokha pattern on the wall here you can shade it black yes you can draw like this it is not compulsory to draw because this type of question are not being asked in the exam okay so that is enough for today we will end our lecture here and i have uploaded one pdf file also in which some question answer are given so that you have to write that question in your notebook thank you